My name is Roz Thompson and I'm with AAA Northeast. Today's presentation will be on the dangers of distracted driving. During this presentation we will talk about three different types of things. We'll talk about what is distracted driving, the different types of distracted driving, and how can we prevent distracted driving. Distracted driving is at its worst is an unseat belted driver multitasking behind the wheel. One of the culprits that is uh, very, very uh, detrimental to distracted driving is the cell phone. It's a distraction and we all know that even if we're not driving, that we can't do anything without it. It's not illegal to eat a sandwich behind the wheel, a drink, but this causes accidents. And if you have an accident while doing it, then you're considered a reckless driver. 65% of near-miss accidents are caused by distracted drivers fussing with the food. The guy in the back seat, can somebody tell me what's wrong with this picture? No, no seatbelt, and leaving forward, and he is distracting the driver by doing what? Thank you. Well, let's go to the lipstick, ladies. How we're multitasking behind the wheel and we got to put on makeup and eyeliner and rouge and... And let's stay right here with the selfies. We're Snapchatting at the stop sign and we want everybody to know, hey, listen to me, look at me, I'm driving. Teen driver risk profile. What factors put teen drivers at risk? Speeding and tailgating is the first on the list. It should be cell phones, but teens are more likely to speed and tailgate more than adults, older drivers rather. You're not supposed to drive between 11 and five. You're not supposed to use the cell phone. You're supposed to put your seatbelt, everyone in the car is supposed to have on their seatbelts. Everyone. During today's presentation, we spoke about the different types of distracted driving and just how dangerous it is. Distracted driving is everyone's problem. Help me to spread the word on how we can prevent driving distracted.